Welcome to another episode of Carbs. Right, because you know, sure, we're in the car. And BS, welcome to be Carbs. Matt Tyner. We're at Popeyes. They finally released some some new chicken that's at least interesting. Because the last couple they've released, I was like, eh. I mean, this this company always does good views for us. Uh, I'm always kind of mixed on them. The last couple things we reviewed, though, I've liked. But like I said, it kind of goes back and forth depending on what the item is. This one has a really cool name, so we're gonna go for it. This is the beer can ripping chicken. And now it says, this is an all white meat chicken breast cut into strips and marinated in garlic, rosemary, cayenne, and lemon zest. The seasonings that make a beer can chicken a classic southern experience. Served with a choice of a signature side buttermilk biscuit and creamy cayenne dipping sauce. It's a perfect meal for $3.99. So let's get into this bad boy. But also follow me on Snapchat. Matt Zion Wee is the username. Send me pictures of your pets, like your puppies and your kitties. I love getting those, so. All right, good big old box here. I did not get dipping sauce, but that's, to be fair, I didn't ask for it. I really didn't ask for anything other than the chicken. She's like, what sides do you want? I don't really remember their sides because I never eat at Popeyes, like, ever. So she just gave me random sides, which is fine. That's totally cool. They gave me a biscuit and they gave me some, it, was, it looks like it's mashed potatoes. Yeah, you can always just take that home, save that for later, but beer can chicken. Is what we came for and it kind of looks like an octopus i don't know what's going on with that but i guess because you have to rip it right that's the idea but it looks like an octopus all right so let's rip at it try this thing out and see if we can taste any difference in this chicken here we go lots of miscellaneous flavors in this thing wow really good as it melts in your mouth this is really good chicken very different this doesn't taste like anything i've had from them before that's really good the second bite was a little too uh, bready, so hopefully the next one. I want more chicken in this. Still a really weird experience pulling it off from the big massive source. Yeah, I would say my complaint here is that there's too much of the uh, batter on it, not enough chicken itself. Let's take a bite into this massive piece here though and see if that's different. That piece is real good. Lots of chicken, so obviously that will work for me. I think $4 is kind of the the highest price I'd be willing to pay for this combo. Getting the biscuit, the side of mashed potatoes, and then the one piece of chicken where you're tearing off other pieces. So strange. It's good. I, I think the flavor is nice. It's a good melt-in-your-mouth chicken, but there's just way too much of that batter on there. Because I'm not getting enough chicken in the long haul. It would be a nice lunch. I would still argue you could go to other fast food places and probably get the same amount of food for cheaper but again Popeyes is kind of known to be just a little bit more expensive than usual but they, have, they do have good food even though I'm a KFC guy I said in every Popeyes video they do have good food this is definitely not bad I would rate it a low four I just think I think they've had better before I think that it does melt well in your mouth but you're just you're not getting enough chicken you got to get way more chicken than that <laughs> considering how much you actually like it on the picture it makes it look like it's just so much more granted it's the picture i get it i get it don't want to be on my ball but yeah either way that is the beer can ripping chicken just rip that shit apart mad zion saying what are your thoughts on this let me know in the comments down below and we'll see you on the next episode